The fascinating moving helmet you see the Apache pilots use today to fly their aircraft is a product of over 40 years of development, 15 of which was done by South African engineers. But how did this come about? Well, let me tell you. The story begins in the late 1970s, when the U.S. Army was developing the AH-64 Apache. One of the main goals for this new attack helicopter was to give it the ability to operate in all weather conditions. The way they planned to do this was by giving the pilot an advanced helmet-mounted sight that would allow them to track and engage targets without having to take their eyes off of the target. In 1981, the U.S. Army approached South Africa to assist them in developing this new technology. At the time, South Africa had been at war in Angola for over a decade, and their pilots had gained valuable experience in using night vision devices in combat. They also had a company called Danel, which was one of the most advanced defense technology companies in the world. Danel had already developed a helmet-mounted sight for use on their indigenous attack helicopter, the AH-2 Alouette III. The pilot could use the joystick to control the movement of the display, which showed a wide-angle view of the area in front of the helicopter. This allowed the pilot to keep their eyes on the target while keeping the helicopter stable and on course. After evaluating the HMDS, the U.S. Army decided to work with Danel to further develop the technology for use on the Apache. The result was the Integrated Helmet and Display Sighting System, or IHADAS. So what makes IHADAS so special? Well, for starters, it uses a fiber optic cable that connects the helmet to a control box in the helicopter. This allows the pilot to have a much wider field of view than with the HMDS. Additionally, the AHADA system can be used to control the helicopter's weapons, meaning that the pilot can fire the aircraft's guns or launch missiles simply by pointing the nose of the helicopter in the desired direction. The Ihada system was first introduced on the Apache in 1985 and has since been upgraded several times. Ihada 3 features a high-resolution color display that provides the pilot with even more information, such as airspeed, altitude, and fuel level. It also has a built-in thermal imaging camera that allows the pilot to see in the dark or through dust, smoke, and fog. The success of the Apache and its Ihada system has led to other military aircraft also adopting helmet-mounted sights. So there you have it. And South Africa played a pivotal role. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video.